This is a great opportunity for people to come down and see the police in a friendly light, get to know them. It's called the National Night Out Against Crime, and Chicopee residents are taking part at the Sarah Jane Sherman Park. You know that every room has how many exits? Two. A way to connect the community with the local police department in a fun and relaxing environment. It's very important to get the community together with the police department, uh, make children aware that we're not their enemies, we're their friends. We're here to help them. While the goal of tonight's event is to educate the community, many just want to have a ball. We've got a lot of fun things going on. We've got bounce houses, we've got police demonstrations, we've got Steel, the mascot from the Springfield Armor, face painting. We just spend time with family and friends and just have fun. So what are you guys doing here? Having fun. <laughs> and the event everyone was waiting for, the annual wing eating contest between the Chickabee High and Chickabee Comp football teams. I think I speak for everyone, including all the teams. You know, we're really excited. We really want to win this, and this just sort of kicks off like the whole rivalry. We actually went out to Hooters the other night to start preparing for it. <laughs> Bought some wings and started chowing down. The winners by just a few wings. Four goes to the Pacers of Chickabee High School. Three in a row. It was tough, it was a little hot, started getting a little sweaty, a little thirsty, but totally worth it in the end. But it's not all fun and games. Organizers say this annual event has helped the community come a long way in the fight against crime.